Hi guys, um, there's a condition called acanthosis nigrans I want to talk about. This is basically hyperpigmentation in the body folds of the, you know, underneath the armpits, the forehead, um, the groin, uh, different parts of the body where it's kind of a darkened appearance. Now, if you see someone like this or you have this, you can pretty much know for sure what they're consuming. It's refined carbohydrates, they're eating frequently because what causes this condition is high levels of insulin, okay? Or insulin resistance, which then causes high levels of insulin. Um, so that's a pre-diabetic situation. And this person could also be a diabetic as well. Um, but I just wanna let you know that this can be reversed if you reduce the insulin, okay? So I put a link down below of some possible things you can do relating to diet. Uh, doing intermittent fasting, ketosis is a really good thing. But I want to also mention there's another condition that can mimic a version of this called pellagra. It's not as common, but pellagra can give you a similar appearance around your neck. Okay? Um, pellagra is a B3 deficiency. In the early 1900s, uh, more people died of this vitamin deficiency than any other vitamin deficiency ever Okay, in the U.S. Um, and basically, the, where that came from is people consuming milled corn, ground up cornmeal, like in grits, okay, in the South. So that creates a serious deficiency of vitamin B3. So again, if you have this condition and your blood sugars are normal and you're consuming a lot of corn products, grits, uh, corn chips, cornmeal, you know, that could be another possibility. But if you're consuming that, chances are your blood sugars are off as well. But I put a link down below to give you more information on how to help manage this insulin. So if you have this condition, watch this. If you know someone, share it with them. All right, thanks for watching. Hey, thank you so much for watching. Keep spreading the word and share this video.